the United States of America, USA or USA, commonly known as the United States, US or simply America, is a country primarily located in North America. Washington, D.C. is the capital of USA and New York is the largest city. The United States is a highly developed country and it is the world's largest importer and second largest exporter of goods. The History of United States The history of United States began with the arrival of Native Americans in North America around 15,000 BC. Numerous indigenous culture formed and many saw transformations in the 16th century away from more densely populated lifestyles and towards reorganized politics elsewhere. The arrival of Christopher Columbus in 1492 started the European colonization of the Americans. Most colonies formed after 16,000 and the United States was the first nation whose most distant origins are fully recorded. On September 9, 1776, the Continental Congress formally declares the name of the new nation to be the United States of America. This replaced the term United Colonies, which had been in general use. Population of USA Based on Worldometer elaboration of the latest United Nations data, the current population of U.S. in 2022 is 334,805,269. Language in USA Although the United States does not have an official language, the most commonly used language is English, specifically American English, which is the de facto national language and the only one spoken at home by approximately 78% of the U.S. population. Many other languages are also spoken at home, especially Spanish, 13.4% of the population. Government of USA The federal government is composed of three distinct branches, legislative, executive, and judicial, whose powers are vested by the U.S. Constitution in the Congress, the President, and the federal courts respectively. Capital of USA Since the U.S. Congress established by the Constitution in 1789, it has convened in three locations, New York City, Philadelphia, and its permanent home in Washington, D.C. New York City was the capital of the United States from 1785 until 1790 and has been the largest U.S. city since 1790. Philadelphia was the early capital of the United States after the Constitution was ratified, but on May 14, 18,000, the nation's capital moved to Washington, D.C. Climate in USA The climate in the USA also varies depending on location. It is considered mostly temperate but is tropical in Hawaii and Florida, Arctic in Alaska, semi-arid in the plains west of the Mississippi River, and arid in the Great Basin of the Southwest. Agricultural crops in USA Corn, wheat, soybeans, cotton, and hay account for 90% of harvested acreage in the United States. Corn, wheat, and soybeans are grown for both animal feed and human consumption. Cotton is used to make clothing and other products. The largest United States crop in terms of total production is corn, the majority of which is grown in a region known as the Corn Belt. The second largest crop grown in the United States is soybeans. As sweet corn, soybeans are primarily grown in the Midwestern states. Religion The United States remain a predominantly Christian nation, with 78% of all adults identifying with the Christian faith, and more than 9 in 10 of those who have religious identity identifying as Christians. Just over 40% of Americans report that religion plays a very important role in their lives. A proportion unique among developed countries, freedom of religion in the United States is guaranteed in the First Amendment to the United States Constitution. Here are the religion in the United States. Protestant, 
has 42%, Catholic has 21%, Mormon 2%, Unaffiliated 18%, Atheist 5%, Agnostic 6%, Jewish 1%, Muslim 1%, Hindu 1%, Buddhist 1%, Other Religion 2%, and Unanswered has 1%. American cuisine is the cooking style and traditional food dishes prepared in the United States, primarily European in origin. It has been significantly influenced by indigenous Native Americans, African Americans, Asians, Pacific Islanders, and many other cultures and traditions, thus reflecting the diverse history of the United States. The national dish of USA is your favorite, hamburger. It's a popular sandwich made of bun or sliced bread rolls stuffed with veggies, sauces, cheese, and of course, beef patties then grilled to perfection. What is a national dish? A national dish of any country is its cultural identity and defines the culinary culture of that place. Made with locally available ingredients, a national dish is decided by organizations through voting. Famous dishes in USA First is the hamburger. It is the most popular sandwich that has beef patties and vegetables. Buffalo wings is an unbreaded chicken wing that is deep fried and coated or dipped in a sauce consisting of vinegar-based cayenne pepper, hot sauce, and melted butter. Apple pie is generally double-crusted pastry that has apple fillings. Chili con carne means chili with meat. It contains ground or minced beef, chili peppers, and tomatoes. Hot dogs in America are mostly sold at stands and carts. It is a food consisting of a grilled or steamed sausage served in the slit of a sliced bun. Macaroni and cheese or mac and cheese is simply macaroni pasta and cheddar cheese sauce. Fried chicken is a dish of chicken pieces coated with flour and is deep fried. Deep dish pizza is baked in a round steel pan that reassembles a cake or pie pan. Cheese steak is a popular sandwich made from thinly sliced pieces of beef steak and melted cheese in a long hoagie roll. Clam chowder is any several chowder soups in American cuisine containing clams. Reuben sandwich, a North American grilled sandwich composed of corned beef, Swiss cheese, sauerkraut, and Thousand Island dressing grilled between slices of bread. Meatloaf is a dish of ground meat that has been combined with other ingredients and formed into the shape of a loaf then baked or smooth. Chicken fried steak, also known as country fried steak or CFS, is an American breaded cutlet dish consisting of a piece of beef steak, most often tenderized cube steak, coated with seasoned flour and either deep fried or pan fried. Chicken and waffles is an American dish combining chicken with waffles. It is part of a variety of culinary traditions, including Pennsylvania Dutch cuisine and soul food, and is served in certain specialty restaurants in the United States. Cheeseburger is a hamburger topped with cheese. Traditionally, the slice of cheese is placed on the top of the meat patty. The cheese is usually added to the cooking hamburger patty shortly before serving. Chocolate chip cookie is a drop cookie that features chocolate chips or chocolate mor morsels as its distinguishing ingredient. Chocolate chip cookies originated in the United States around 1938 when Ruth Graves Wakefield chopped up a Nestle semi-sweet chocolate bar and added the chopped chocolate to a cookie recipe. Cornbread is a quick bread made with cornmeal associated with the cuisine of the southern United States. With origins in Native American cuisine, it is an example of butter bread, dumplings, and pancakes made with finely ground cornmeal. Our staple food in the Hopi people in Arizona. Lobster roll is a dish native to New England. 
It is made of lobster meat served on a grilled hot dog style bun. French fries are served hot, either soft or crispy, and are generally eaten as part of lunch or dinner or by themselves as a snack, and they commonly appear on the menus of dinners, fast food restaurants, pubs, and bars. Tacos Consisting of a small hand-sized corn or wet tortilla, topped with a filling. The tortilla is then folded around the filling and eaten by hand. A taco can be made with a variety of fillings including beef, pork, chicken, seafood beans, vegetables, and cheese allowing for great versatility and variety. Fajitas A dish consisting of strips of spiced beef, or chicken chop, vegetables, and grated cheese wrapped in a soft tortilla and often served with a sour cream. Herbs and Spices in the USA Allspice, also known as Jamaica pepper, myrtle pepper, pimenta or pimento, is the dried and ripe berry of pimenta, Jayarica, a meat canopy pre-native to the greater Antilles, Southern Mexico, and Central America, now cultivated in many warm parts of the world. Spearmint, or menta spicata, is a pleasant-smelling species of meat found in health food products, toothpaste, mouthwashes, and cosmetics. It is often used in medicine for its clean, therapeutic properties. Oregano is an herb composed of the fresh or dried leaves of the oregano plant. The plant has tiny leaves that lend a potent aroma and strong flavor to a variety of savory food. Cinnamon Cinnamon is used mainly as an aromatic condiment and flavoring additive in a wide variety of cuisines. Sweet and savory dishes, breakfast cereals, snack foods, teas, and traditional foods. Vanilla the characteristic flavor of vanilla comes from the aromatic compound vanillin, which is described as tasting like a marshmallow. In vanilla pods, of exceptionally high quality, the crystallized vanillin may be visible on the surface in the form of tiny white needles. Camino, used in soups, stews, and even cheeses. With its distinctive aroma and taste, cumin is the second most popular spice in the world, next to black pepper. With its strong, sharp flavor and its distinctive taste, cumin makes a wonderful addition to everyone's pantry. Canada is located in the top half of North America and the country is bordered by the three oceans, Pacific Ocean, Atlantic Ocean, and Arctic Ocean, covering 9.98 million square kilometers, making it the world's second largest country by total area. The history of Canada covers the period from the arrival of Paleo-Indians to North America thousands of years ago to the present day. Prior to European colonizations, the land encompassing present-day, Canada were inhabited for millennia by indigenous peoples with distinct trade networks, spiritual beliefs, and styles of social organizations. The now British province of Quebec was divided into Upper and Lower Canada in 1791. The two provinces were united as the province of Canada by the Act of Union 1840, which came into force in 1841. Canada is a country in North America, its 10 provinces and 3 territories extend from the Atlantic Ocean to the Pacific Ocean and northward into Arctic Ocean. Population The current population of Canada is 38,341,304 based on the world meter elaboration of the latest United Nations data. Canada in 2020 population is estimated at 37,742,154 people at mid-year according to UN data, Canada population is equivalent to 0.48 of the total world population. Language in Canada Since the establishment of the Canadian state, English and French have been the co-official languages and are by far the most spoken languages in the country today. 
According to the 2016 census, English and French are the mother tongues of 56% and 21.4% of Canadians, respectively. In total, 86.2% of Canadians have working knowledge of English, while 29.8% have a working knowledge of French. The Government of Canada is the body responsible for the Federal Administration of Canada. A constitutional monarchy, the Crown is the corporation's soul. Assuming distinct roles, the Executive as the Crown in Council, the Legislature as the Crown in Parliament, and the Courts as the Crown of the Bench. Three institutions, the Privy Council, conventionally the Cabinet, the Parliament of Canada, and the Judiciary respect respectively exercise the powers of the Crown. Ottawa, the capital city of Canada, located on the south bank of Ottawa River in the southern portion of the province of Ontario. Canada's capital is also the second largest city in Ontario with a regional population of close to 1.5 million people. Climate of Canada Canada has a mainly cold climate with short, warm summers and long, frigid winters. The northern and central portions experience a subarctic climate. The extreme south is mostly humid continental, a small portion of which is a cold semi-arid desert. The southwestern Pacific coast has an oceanic climate. Canada lies in North America and shares a vast border with the United States in the south and Alaska in the northwest. The Pacific Ocean lies in the west, the Arctic in the north, and the Atlantic in the east. The high latitudes lack of mountains to shield polar air masses and cold currents that are the main factors that influence the climate. Agriculture crops in Canada Major field crops grown in Canada include wheat, canola, barley, corn, and soybeans. Other crops include rye, oats, white beans, and mixed grains. Several specialty crops, which are limited to a very small area of land, are also grown in certain religions. Did you know that Canada is the largest exporter of beans, peas, chickpeas, and lentils? And the crop grown with the largest acreage in Canada is wheat followed by canola. Religion in Canada Religion in Canada encompasses a wide range of groups and beliefs. Roman Catholic having the most adherents, 38.7%. People having no religious affiliation is 23.9%. Protestants, 23.5%. Other faiths include Anglican, 5%. Muslims, 3.2%. Hindu, 1.5%. Sikh, 1.4%. Buddhist, 1.1%. Jewish, 1%. Other religions, 0.7%. Christians representing 67.2% of the population in 2011. However, Canada has no official religion and support for religious pluralism and freedom of religion is an important part of Canada's political culture. History of Canadian Cuisine Canadian cuisine has been shaped and impacted by those of indigenous people settlers, and immigrants. Indigenous influences are still prevalent in Canada's contemporary food scene. Alongside with that of the three major immigrant groups of the 17th and 18th centuries, English, Scottish, and French. This diversity has been expanded further with the subsequent waves of immigration in later centuries. The traditional indigenous cuisine of Canada is based on mixture of wild game, forage foods, and form agricultural products. National dish in Canada, poutine. Poutine is a French-Canadian meal featuring three ingredients, fries, cheese curds, and gravy. This 
Created in the 1950s in Quebec, the dish can be found everywhere today. Many eaters even serve the traditional poutine with additional flavors such as butter, chicken, or pulled pork. Famous dish in Canada Split pea soup is soup made typically from dried peas, such as the split pea. It is with variations a part of the cuisine of many cultures. Saskatoon berry pie is a type of pie with a Saskatoon berry filling. The pie originated in the prairies region of Canada and is often served with vanilla ice cream as a dessert. Female bacon is a wet cured and smoked back bacon made from trim lean boneless pork loin rolled in cornmeal. It is found mainly in Ontario. Montreal style smoked meat. Montreal smoked meat or simply smoked meat in Quebec is a type of kosher style deli meat product made by salting and curing beef brisket with spices. Tortier is a French Canadian meat pie dish originating from the province of Quebec, usually made with minced pork, veal or beef, and potatoes. A butter tart is a type of a small pastry tart, highly regarded in Canadian cuisine and considered one of the Canada's quintessential treats. Molten syrup being poured on clean white snow to create the soft maple candy. Flapper pie. Flapper pie is a vanilla custard pie topped with meringue. The pie is a staple of the Canadian prairie culture. Back bacon. Canadian back bacon is naturally smoked and makes any breakfast sandwich irresistible. Bannock. It is a variety of flat, quick bread or any large, round article baked or cooked from grain. Nanaimo bars. The Nanaimo bars was popularized nationwide after being highlighted as a classic Canadian dessert. It requires no baking and consists of three layers, a wafer, nut, and coconut crumb base custard icing in the middle, and a layer of chocolate ganache on top. Timbits Timbits are bite-sized, sweet Canadian dough balls which are prepared using sweetened dough. The dough is then fried and covered with frosting or powdered sugar. Herbs and Spices in Canada Coriander Coriander refers to the dried fruit on the coriander plant which can be found whole or ground. Coriander seeds are extremely aromatic, with a slight lemony flavor, making it a great addition to dry rubs and curries. Anise Anise, also called aniseed or rarely anix, is a flowering plant native to the eastern Mediterranean region and southwest Asia. The flavor and aroma of its seeds have similarities with some other spices and herbs such as star anise, fennel, licorice, and tarragon. Ginger Ginger is one of the most used rhizomes in the world. Both as an aromatic and as a health food, it is mostly used in the Asian culinary traditions and was one of the first exotic spices to be brought to Europe. Mainly by Arabic spice traders, ginger is originally native to India and parts of Southeast Asia as well as other parts of the tropics like Africa and the Caribbean. Bay leaves Bay leaves are a cross between a spice and a herb. They can be used fresh or dried and are used in cuisines ranging from Mediterranean, West Indian, Indonesian, Mexican, and Indian. Even though they appear to be ubiquitous, bay leaves differ from each other in their flavor, size, and appearance. Bay leaves are dark green in color, changing to a deep khaki once they are dried. Turmeric Turmeric is a common spice that comes from the root or curcuma longa. It contains a chemical called curcumin which might produce swelling. Turmeric has a warm bitter taste and is frequently used to flavor or color curry powders, mustards, butters, and cheeses. Nutmeg. 
Nutmeg is the seed or John spice of several species of the genus Myristica. Myristica fragrance is a dark leaf evergreen tree cultivated for two spices derived from its fruit nutmeg, from its seed and maize from the seed covering. Cloves are best known as sweet and aromatic spice that contains fiber, vitamins, and minerals. Pepper has pungent smell, peppery hot taste, and health-friendly properties. Paprika is a spice made from dried and ground red peppers. Cinnamon is mainly used as an aromatic condiment flavoring additive in a wide variety of cuisines. Chili powder is a dried pulverized fruit of one or more varieties of chili pepper and a spice used to add pungency and flavor to culinary dishes. Cayenne pepper. Cayenne is used in cooking spicy dishes, either as a powder or in its whole form. It is a moderately hot chili pepper used to flavor dishes.